Hi everyone, Chief Steve here. Welcome back to another achievement guide. Today I'm going to show you how to get a couple of achievements in Shredders. This is the new game available on Game Pass. If you like this guide, please like, comment, and subscribe. I'm going to show you a bunch of these easier achievements for Alpha Start as we get going. Starting off with this little glitch here that I found. And we're going to move right into the level 540 Indie, 540 Indie. We're getting the achievement brand manager for landing a 540 Indie. So on these jumps, what do you have to do? You, I couldn't do it on this jump. You have to hold right on the analog stick to spin. Plus hold right bumper to grab your board. So you start off the spinning right before you jump as I do there. Like before you jump off the ramp. So when you jump, you're already spinning. You're holding your board. And as simple as that, a couple of spins and I do it twice there in a row. Next, we're going to go shortly after to meet the snowmobile. I'm going to show you how to get a bunch of achievements in this area. Some naturally, some if you want to uh, go for them a little bit. Like you're going to have to put a little bit of work into some of these. So the point in this, and I'm going to speed this up. You have to hold left bumper and right bumper to start up your snowmobile. And you're starting a snowmobile that's going to carry you throughout the level. If you hold left bumper and right bumper, and then let go, he'll drive away. And then you can call them back and you can keep doing this over and over to call them the snowmobile um, 50 times, 500 times for some achievements. But as well, this will help you get the achievement ride 10 kilometers with the snowmobile if you want to just repeat this a few times. Because right. it goes pretty far up that mountain so you get several kilometers in there. And then at the top we've got the what's go up achievement. Again, this is something that you're not going to get naturally. But you can see that we're going down this really big hill and there's some jumps here we can hit with a lot of speed to do some tricks and practice, which I recommend. But you can see that there's a long stretch of ways to go. And this area is good for getting the achievement knee high, which is for riding 10 kilometers of deep snow. I just restarted this a like a bunch of times, like five times or 10 times, and I got it pretty easily. Then we're gonna move on to side hits euphoria uh, shortly afterwards. And you'll notice as we go off this first jump, there's an S there. Make sure to hit it. And you can wipe out like I do here, just so I can restart. And we've got the S. We don't need to worry about that again. And you can do some tricks, as you need 5,000 for the main objective in this level. We're going to get the achievement Spelling Bee for collecting all five letters of Shred in the level. There's the H there, which I thought I was going to miss, so I just restarted that checkpoint. And you can see, like I said before, the H is already there, and we're totally fine. Moving on to the R here on the tailpipe, which I did not get enough speed on, and I kind of slowly fell off right there. And we're going to continue down this course. This E here I found trickier. See, it's a bit higher up. We barely cleared it. But there's where we'll find the E in Tread. Last but not least, I wasn't jumping soon enough, so make sure you get in that jump off, collect the D, and we're right at the end of the level. There's all five letters of Shred, and there's our achievement. Then we're moving on to level 3579. We're going to get the achievement spin like it's 1998 for landing a 1080. So you can see these really big jumps here. And our objective is to do a 360. So when you're going off a jump like before, you want to already have be pushing the right analog stick to the side. That will force you to jump and you can see right there pretty easily I do a 1080. Then a couple later levels later, just two levels later, we're doing castles made of snow. And this one we're going to do a land double backflip. This one I kind of got in a weird way, so I'm going to show you two ways I was able to get this. Um, as oh, well, this one might not make a whole lot of sense, so we're going to the second jump here. I'm going to jump off to the side a little bit, and I do a backflip. Then I kind of start to do one there, like I slowly fall backwards and pull myself back. I landed a double backflip there, and I got an achievement. But you can see this other level, um, after we've done these levels, we're going to go to the bottom of this mountain just to go to another level. And I'm going to show you another way I did the backflip. So we're just going a little bit farther down. I'm going to this jump here. And I messed that one up, so I redid this. I was able just to land a backflip. 
um, not quite here. It took me a lot of tries actually. Here's a couple of fill attempts, but just landed a backflip. There's your achievement. Looks easy on TV for landing a backflip. Hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you found some of these achievements not too bad. And I'll see you in the next achievement hunting video. Thanks. Bye for now.